Hawaii is a special and powerful place. I've always been fascinated by its history. On Lulu Airport, ancient Polynesians arrived in the islands from Tahiti, two and a half thousand miles away, in traditional double-hulled voyage canoes. Those Polynesian wayfinders were like ancient astronauts, completing incredible voyages of discovery. When the day is closing in, Look who's here! Daniel at the wheel! So baby, take a look at it! Dan Skorowski is like an absolute legend. He's one of the most underground big wave chargers in, in Europe, in my opinion. Um, I was stoked he also got an invite to the Mike Stewart Pipeline Invitational. Um, he really deserved it. Just arrived at Pipeline Car Park. We just had a quick, quick rest after all the, the madness with the airports and getting here. Finish our pastries. Is that off the wall down there then? Oh, Mr. Klein! SBMPO. SBMPO, it means Strandhill Boys Never Pull Out. Uh, my friend Aiden Byrne came up with that. He's, he's in Japan now. He also made me these Ace uh, Bodyboard magazine covers in full SBMPO style. Cool. Anyways, cool. I got second. I'm pretty stoked. But guess, look at this guy, man. The hour. Numero uno. I was stoked with my heat, but Dan did amazing in his first heat. He got two smokers and came first. He's did amazing. I got one good wave, but I knew I needed another score. In the time minutes my heat, I took off on a small inside wave and pulled in and somehow managed to come out of it and get the score I needed to progress. It beats Ben Severson. So, I'm with Landon, I get some shakas. And this is my mate. Yeah. He's killing it this morning. In my next seat, I was feeling a bit more pressure up against three Hawaiian competitors. I got one good wave about midway through my heat. But I couldn't find the score to back it up. Uh, I got third and knocked out of the competition. But me and Dan were looking forward to day two of the competition and seeing who'd be crowned uh, Pipeline Champions for 2017.